Will the future of clean energy be powered by the stars? Well, it's not as far-fetched as it might sound. Thanks to the team at the UK-based JET Laboratory, the dream of limitless clean power is a step closer to becoming a reality. Let's journey back in time to the late 70s, when the Joint European Taurus, or JET, was constructed in Cullum, Oxford. This experimental fusion reactor was the brainchild of an international collaboration between the UK, Europe, Switzerland and Ukraine. Funded predominantly by the EU nuclear research program Euratom and operated by the UK Atomic Energy Agency, the JET facility was at the forefront of nuclear fusion research. Despite initial expectations of a decade-long operational lifespan, the reactor's life was extended due to repeated successes. Fast forward to the present day and the JET laboratory is celebrating a world record. The final experiment, which marks over four decades of fusion research, produced more energy than any previous attempt. This result, triple that of similar tests in 1997, is a testament to the tireless efforts and collaboration of hundreds of scientists and engineers from across Europe. But what exactly is nuclear fusion? It's the process that powers stars, including our Sun. By heating and forcing tiny particles together to form a heavier one, a significant amount of energy is released. If we can successfully scale this process up to commercial levels, we could produce endless amounts of clean energy without any carbon emissions. This energy source wouldn't be at the mercy of weather conditions, unlike wind and solar energy, but don't start celebrating just yet. As explained by Dr. Anika Khan, research fellow in nuclear fusion at the University of Manchester, achieving nuclear fusion on Earth is not straightforward. It requires temperatures 10 times hotter than the sun, around 100 million degrees Celsius, and a high enough density of atoms for a long enough time. The recent experiment at JET produced 69 megajoules of energy over five seconds. To put that into perspective, that's only enough energy for four to five hot baths. Clearly, we're still some way off from nuclear fusion power plants, but every experiment brings us one step closer. In the words of Prof. Ambrogio Fasoli, program manager at Eurofusion, this successful demonstration instills greater confidence in the development of fusion energy. Beyond setting a new record, the team achieved things they've never done before and deepened our understanding of fusion physics. In summary, the recent breakthrough at the JET Laboratory marks a significant milestone in the journey towards achieving nuclear fusion. While we're still a long way off from seeing fusion power plants, the progress made is encouraging. The dream of harnessing the power of the stars for clean, limitless energy is slowly but surely becoming a reality. The future of clean energy is looking brighter than ever thanks to the groundbreaking work of the international team of scientists and engineers at JET.